Hello Ratbags, it's Jade with an Assassin's Creed video today, again showing you some of the legendary creatures. This one's south of London in Sussex, and we're going to be taking on a bunch of bulls and a cow. But, I have to say right now, I didn't actually defeat these creatures on my own. I had a little bit of extra help, and I'm going to talk you through exactly what happened, because it is the funniest thing I think I've seen in Assassin's Creed, or certainly one of the weirdest. You'll find a little town that's covered in dead bodies, dead creatures, all sorts of bad shizzles going on here. A little tale says that someone has been unhappy being a farmer and he's kind of left and gone off somewhere and his dad probably wasn't best too pleased as he's been breeding his cows to go and fight in the wars, apparently. As said, this is one of the legendary missions, so if you want to complete all the legendary hunts, you've got to do it. So I went ahead and just started uh, wailing on this little cow, thinking, yeah, this is it. I can see the great big grey one. He's going to be the big bad, right? But the rest of them will start attacking you. This is actually one of the challenging fights I've had. Obviously, I am massively underpowered. These are like 260. I think I was like level 110. I have to say, I've been doing this a lot because I've just been enjoying it and of course it makes for a better video if I can say to you guys I defeated a legendary creature and I was 110 or 120 levels below it. I've shown you guys how to beat some of the zealots and I've shown you guys some of the other legendary creatures and I've got more incoming as well. It's not always this difficult though and I will be showing you some easy ones where I'm more or less the same level. But yeah, I'll take the opportunity where I can and I'll like testing my stuff out to see if I can come up with ways to do it. Now initially he's pretty good. If you can use the slowdown which is like my favourite skill, you'll find that really in the raven area I think it is or just raven bear slides, you will be able to pretty much manoeuvre quite a bit. He's fairly easy easy if you concentrate just on him on his own in the beginning stages. He'll kick a big throw left and right when he does his red attack and then the actual little parry attack he does there is usually only one but Problems start happening though when you accidentally hit some of the other cows or sows or bulls and they'll all start attacking you and then yeah it becomes a real challenge. I've got a mythical armor set on which I nabbed from Amazon Prime, I'm going to show you guys that as well in a future video, but it is pretty much just a case of trying to wail on the big guy and avoid the smaller attacks from the smaller ones. Also if you manage to shoot all of its big sensitive parts, you will be able to go ahead and give him some fairly massive damage by stomping on him with the animation where you put an axe to his head. Clearly this fight is going to be a lot easier if you're more high level or you've got some better decent weapons than I have. I pretty much have still got just superior axes. I was trying all my abilities here and seeing if there was a way to get my stamina bars back up and get more adrenaline going. Here's what I had on. I like to have mythological armour but my weapons are still not that great. I'm going though for the dual axes. I tried a big big bit with the spears and it was good and I ended up revisiting with the spears but I thought maybe I need to go to the tried and trust method that I'd used on all the zealots. If you don't know what that method is, it's pretty much hold the L1 button with any dual wielding weapons, normally small stuff like this or knives or daggers, and you will do quite a punishing attack. That builds up your adrenaline bar and then you can go ahead and use your special abilities. And done correctly, it's a great way to refill stuff. But as you can see, the bulls get enraged. They were pretty much ignoring me for the first stages. But once you get them to around 70% health, they'll activate, he'll pretty much put a call out and they'll just come after you and after you. It's really tough taking these guys out at this level as well. Again, I'm just being stupid probably doing this too early, but I want to see if I can. I like the challenge of it and you can take them down. I have tried my best. It does take a while. I managed to defeat two of them before I ended up getting owned. That in mind, I decided to switch it up and go for the Magister's armor, which I haven't rated very good yet at the moment. I just don't think it's that great, but it is meant to be giving more damage at night time. It's more or less night time right now. So I thought, yeah, we'll give it a try and see if it does do that. It also gives more range damage too. So yeah, I still think this is a viable method for you. If you're higher level, you should be able to just do what I'm doing here, using your axes and going for it with that spam attack. And then when he activates the balls, then you might want to take them out. You might want to try taking them out a bit earlier and I'm not too sure if you take him out maybe it reduces his health or his sort of functions I don't know I was calling in my wolf that was beneficial for a little while as well to try and distract some of these guys and it kind of did work as well but you need upgrade two so he sticks around otherwise he'll just tackle one and then he'll go away so you definitely need the upgrade twice for that one man's best friend but you can see they're all chasing me around it's pretty tough 
So around three deaths later, things started getting a little bit weird. I kid you not, I wasn't really expecting this, but I got the little helping hand from some locals. Now originally when they first jumped in, they weren't very good. In fact, they were out to really pretty much muck me up alongside the cows. You can see there's a couple of NPCs and they just appeared. They jumped into the pen, one of them's firing arrows at me and the other one does look like he's about to come start running at me as there, you can see him in the middle. I have no idea why. There are patrols that go by, there is a road pretty close, but I wasn't firing at anyone or anything. It wasn't like I was taking my time off these uh, really dangerous cows to go shoot in some of these locals. And you can see I got absolutely murdered, taking my eyes off the ball, wondering why the hell these two were in here. So after much mucking around, trying lots of different combinations of armor, skills, abilities, I pretty much died another five times. Like I said, I was kind of just mooching out. I've been playing this game a lot, and so I tend to get into these states where I'll just keep doing something, even though I really should be probably doing something better with my time. And then something truly magical happened. A lone warrior, a rescuer, someone that I absolutely needed in that moment. A hero came along and saved me from the cows. Honestly, I don't know what went on. I don't know how it happened. I wasn't aiming at anyone or anything with any bows or arrows. I was just wailing on this guy, trying to do my method to get him to half health again before the cows went nuts. And then I was going to just carry on to keep seeing if I could do my spamming attack on him. And you can see it's working pretty well. This is a great method for pretty much any enemy until they patch it. Maybe they'll make it, maybe they won't. I'm not sure. But you do definitely need some fast clean stuff. But look at this guy. Just wading in here. He's horses brown bread. And this NPC, this enemy, started attacking the bull. Like, literally, was just helping me out. I'm not sure if I'm happy that it's maybe a bug or whether or not it's a game feature. If it's a game feature, I love that the devs have realised that if someone's getting their ass owned, they'll send an enemy NPC to help you out a little bit. Now, at this point, I'd actually been doing this for over an hour. Yep, like I said, sometimes I'm just a bit stupid and stubborn. And so I was all down for this guy. Look how much health he's taken away with his mace. This guy was OP. He was doing a job. All I had to do now was avoid all the other cows and make sure I didn't get mauled when I went too close. This guy also could take a beating. They went into him a few times. Obviously, the big one was taking him out quite a bit. And his health was fine by the time... He got round to it, he actually took out this cow, not me. If you get too close to him, he will start attacking you. And I'll show you what happens, how this tail doesn't have a happy ending. So you have got to be a bit careful, don't be too close to him. You can tell this is going to be maybe the, uh, the thumbnail. But there you go, he literally did the job. He took him out and that was it. The rest of them were still going a bit wild. And I thought at this stage, I may start to grow a pair. He even starts going after them though. So I thought, nah, I'm not having this. I can't have this shame. I need to pull my finger out and I need to help out a little bit. It took like another four or five minutes for these cows to be taken out. You can see here, like I said, get too close to them and he will start attacking you too. I had to get the killing blow on the last enemy at least, and that was it. We were done. And now comes the bitter sweet end to our tale. Of course, he's not going to relent. He's after me. He's swinging a mace. Unfortunately, you've got to go, dude. I'm so sorry. So can we get an F in the comments, please, for our mace-wielding friendly NPC who really was just obviously bloodlust, maybe a Viking in disguise, who knows? But for some reason, he decided to help me out, and thank God he did, because it meant that I got this legendary kill. A little bit of a funner, smaller, different take today on these legendary creatures. As always, there's the location. Go and tell me your methods. If it happens to you, let me know, and I'll see you right back for more very, very soon.